we start and wake up, get a little coffee at six, just on the dot or a little earlier. No matter how old you are or what kind of shape you're in, exercise helps every one of us live longer, healthier, more enjoyable lives. We're addressing ourselves to certain domestic priorities, trying to mobilize the nation to do something in education or an anti-drug fight. I think that's a pretty good, uh, good vision for, for a country. So help me God. Together, we must remove the physical barriers we've created and the social barriers that we've accepted. But for ours will never be a truly prosperous nation until all within it prosper. Our responsibility is to help develop approaches that enhance peace prospects. Problems do not resolve themselves. Leaders, acting with courage and vision, solve problems. I'm so very honored to receive the Presidential Medal of Freedom for the greatest country in the free world. Uh, throughout the world, old enemies are finding ways to talk to one another and to end conflicts in a manner that preserves the basic interests of all concerned. Peace, security, and political rights can be attained through direct negotiations. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States and Mrs. Bush. Uh, Barbara and I have just come from burying a time capsule. No live congressman went into it, and I, I, uh, that is my only, only regret. It was here where Boris Yeltsin and I signed the uh, treaty to eliminate all of these SS-18s. It's only one of the many things that have gone on as we've seen this be the backdrop for enormous events in our history. I believe that both Nicaragua and Panama have strong support from the American people. And America is angry about this. If he thought this brutal treatment of pilots is a way to muster world support, he is dead wrong. Tonight, the Kuwaiti flag once again flies above the capital of a free and sovereign nation. And the American flag flies above our embassy. And we join our German friends in looking to the future with hope and confidence to the new beginning this treaty will make possible. Dreams sometimes do come true. Germany is united. Germany is free. I want to put my focus on things I can do something about. Education is not just about making a living. It's also about making a life. And literacy is where education begins. Our Points of Light initiative is a new effort, but its goals are just as old and as traditional as the values that we cherish. And I'm very glad that the President and Mrs. Bush are, are helping more children like me to find parents. All people, young or old, wealthy or poor, possess the traits to truly shine. This is my dream come true. Oh, oh that's oh, wonderful. That, nice? that is really great. We don't inherit the earth from our parents. We borrow it from our children. All of us are simply holding a sacred trust left for future generations. This marvelously majestic house can also be a home. And the grandchildren, of course, uh, are the most important dignitaries to grace this place. to uh, take part in celebrating the achievement of seven outstanding Americans who've just devoted their entire lives to the performing arts. I'd like to leave honor. I'd like to conduct myself in this job with honor. I would like to leave the world a little more peaceful, and the U.S. Uh, can play a significant, if not unique, role in that. Well, it's 
Tänä kerran. Mm-hmm.